Hey everyone, my name is CK Lane, the director of Koji, Convergence of Global Innovators, home for those who are passionate about innovation as a means to solving global issues. You've gotten into grad school of your choice, and now what? Beginning grad school is a challenge. Not only do you have to navigate a new place, meeting new peers, finding new mentors, and engage in rigorous academic activity, you also have to finish on time. The key to accomplish this is to immediately assess where you want to be when you graduate and take the path of least resistance to get there. You can just get by in grad school until your advisor tells you that the funding has ran out, you need to be out in six months. Well, you can. I've seen many people have done that. The worst scenario that could be is sorry the funding has ran out and you're not far enough to graduate go find yourself a new advisor I've seen that too trust me that's no fun no one wants to be in their final year only to find that they have to start all over because of a few missteps therefore make sure to make every step proactive and not reactive you have heard those who fail to plan plan to fail so don't plan to fail. Make sure that people on your team is taken care of and that they are having great chemistry with each other. You don't want two committee members playing politics at your expense, do you? Make sure your working research model is robust and that you produce results on a timely basis. You don't want to get scooped, do you? That's no fun either. Make sure that you manage the research fundings conscientiously. Make sure that you know how long your runway is. Seek out advice on ways to get to where you want to be faster and without a lot of snacks. For those who think this is so obvious, why am I covering this? Well, there is a huge difference between knowing and being. A lot of smart people know a lot of things, but they don't follow commonsensical things. Over the next few weeks, I'll be posting several tactics to accomplish your grad school aspirations quicker and with bigger impact. This is Dr. C.K. Lin, and I look forward to hearing from you in the comments.